Joshua chapter 3, verse 8 says, And as for you, command the priests who bear the Ark of the Covenant, when you come to the brink of the waters of the Jordan, you shall stand still in the Jordan. Now, Joshua chapter 3, verse 8, again, God is talking to Joshua, he's speaking to Joshua, and he's giving him his word. And so Joshua is all ears at this point. And so God says, as for you, this is what I have for you. As for you, Joshua, command the priests, the Levitical priests, they, they're the ones who are carrying the Ark of the Covenant. They're the ones who are going to carry it over into the river. The people are going to stay a half, a half mile away, and they're going to watch. And then they're going to cross the river when God dries it up. But God says, as for you, command the priest. Why, why Joshua? Because Joshua is the commission leader. God has put him in this place of authority over the people. And so God is coming to the leader of Israel saying, okay, now Joshua, lead. You are the leader of Israel, so lead. Command the priests who bear the Ark of the Covenant. When you come to the brink of the waters of the Jordan, when, when you basically dip your toes into the water, you shall stand still in the Jordan. When you come into the Jordan River, you shall stand still in the Jordan. What we're going to see in the coming verses is that as soon as the priests get their feet in the Jordan River, the water stops. The water is held back as far as away as Adam, which is over 15 miles away, but the water stops and then God is going to command. Uh, it, it's going to be a little bit more clear in later verses, but God commands the priests to stand in the middle of the Jordan River, in the midst of it, right there in, in, in the very middle as the people are passing by and they are to wait. The priests are to wait patiently for all 2 million plus people to cross over to the other side. That is what the priests are to do. And so God is telling Joshua, as for you, command the priests who bear the Ark of the Covenant, who bear my name and my symbol and my image, when you come to the brink of the waters of the Jordan, you shall stand still in the Jordan. Because again, where is this covenant going to be, this Ark of the Covenant? It's going to be in the midst of the Jordan. And this is a picture of the, it's a physical representation of the spiritual presence of God among his people. And so it's as if God himself is standing in the middle of the Jordan, holding back the waters and allowing his people to, to pass on to the other side. And so this is Joshua chapter 3, verse 8.